Hi guys, it's Vanessa the Tarot Goddess. And let's see. The Urban Tarot Goddess. <laughs> I'm going to do a reading on the Supremes, which includes uh, Mary Wilson, who has recently passed, uh, Diana Ross, and Florence. Flow. Like it's being called flow. So let's go. And Supreme was a group that was main hits were in the 60s and 70s. Um I even had a, a group member named Cindy Starfall um, who joined later after Florence had was Pretty much put out the group. All right, so let's see what their take on this. I want to know the relationship um, between the group members, Mary, Diana Ross, and Flo. What type of relationship they had together? Okay, I have a, someone being very patient, waiting. Uh, I'm getting that they're doing like a, um, more like the characteristics they're trying to tell me. Um, one was more patient, one's more uh, like an in-between person, kind of balance it out. And I don't seem to be like in control of things, not like in direct control. But like just their, like the upfront person, you know, everything leans toward that person. I'm assuming it's Diana Ross. So that's the, the vibe I'm getting. One of them is more conservative. I feel like that is more of a Florence. And balance is, to me, it's Mary. Yes. Um, however, they did try to keep things together, um, the, just the strength of them having to deal with one another uh, was, was something else back then. Uh, let's see, how did Florence, uh, why did Florence leave the group? Same chorus sort of came out. Um, she left the group due to too many secrets, too many um, people trying to be up front. Uh, she was left out on a lot of things. Uh, she did try to communicate with her group members or people that was working with them. She felt ignored. So she still kind of just sat back. And look, as you can tell, the last card ended up with two and her left behind. Again, the strength card. <laughs> it's like some type of partnership the group members had. Uh, someone favored, someone's in love. Uh, again, she just felt like, okay, the higher fan. Whoever was like a manager type person, kind of like, let that happen. It was their choice to do it like that. Something to do with a relationship. I know in the past, a lot of people in the music industry had relationships that affect 
the, the group. Um, so they tend to, whoever the person up front end up being in a relationship with, with the manager or whoever's in charge tends to be the lead person. So that's what the vibe I'm getting from that, those cards. How did you feel about that? Like, flow. How did you feel about that? She felt like, I mean, that's, if that's what they want, I could go do my own thing. <laughs> uh, again, also they had money issues. Um, she's okay. She's like, they kind of got away with that. That's all right. Um, now I said, when, once you cross over to the other side, it's not a, a bit of a deal. So they're not going to really speak on how they feel at that moment. Um, but she's okay with whatever happened it, it doesn't even matter anymore she just feel like the person kind of like got away with it but that's fine um they also had money issues she felt she was getting paid less i'm getting the word less than the others i believe she's the one who put the group together how does she feel about diana ross how does Florence feel about Diana Ross? I head feel woozy. Did she have like a brain cancer or something? I want to look that up. Oh, she, she like Diana Ross was like the young. Her, I want to say the youngest. She felt like she was just full of life. Um, they went way back childhood. <laughs> way back childhood. Um, very fast. Oh, Lord. She looked at her as a fast person. Is that what she meant? Or it meant that um, they travel a lot together. I'm getting that she's fast. <laughs> um, of The men liked her. Um, she still loved her, close to her heart type person. She does feel bad about, um, okay, she's saying there's, there was, it wasn't always three and the group was four. In the past, they had four girls. It wasn't just three. I'm going to have to look that up too. But, um, four girls. So, yeah, it's like childhood memories. Uh, she feels like Diana Ross was like the, the, the sitting sun, but the sun is the star. Um, that she was the star of the group. That's how she feels. Alright, Lou, what does Florence feel about? How does she feel about Mary Wilson's passing? One, two, three, four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. My head feels really cra crazy right now. I gotta see what she died of. Uh, okay. To the point where I'm like, don't even remember something. I don't have a memory issue. Um. I don't remember my question. <laughs> Lord, let me start that back over. Why the fuck she had like some type of memory issue? Like what's up mentally what's something mentally wrong with Florence? I'm gonna come back to that question. coming out nothing mentally wrong just 
more of an emotional thing again she's on she's talking about the money she was young she felt used she felt like she was used she wants she wants she's like taking over the reading right now uh so how did um let's see what did how did diana diana feel about um how did diana feel about Florence. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, didn't feel like she was a hard worker. Again, a very patient person. She kind of felt like she was some again something about the money. Um very hard working person. Um, very nice. Again, young, emotional. They travel the world together, of course. And she's a business partner. She just felt like that's how it was. Real simple read. I don't think she, Diana gave it much thought about it. How does Mary, what did Mary Wilson feel once, um, Florence left, left the, um, the group? I had to get off of Florence for a minute, cause, ooh, child. <laughs> she loved Florence, of course. She actually felt bad about uh, the struggle that she had. Felt that Florence was betrayed. She feels guilty in a sense too. Uh, but she, like I said, they were young. They kind of wanted to, when you have a taste of the fame, it's, you know, you just kind of go with whatever's popular at the moment. That's how she felt. Did not feel like she betrayed her in some sense? I know her feelings. All right. Did um, okay? I'm gonna ask about Florence. Hopefully, I don't get too woozy again. Did Florence? Um, how did she feel about Cindy joining the group at Diana Ross and the Supremes at the time? I believe. They were called in. <laughs> She's like, that was the end. Let's see, that car came out upside down. She did think about it a lot. It actually made her a little depressed. It made her want to travel further for them, whether emotionally or physically. She just was done. Uh, it's almost like a trek because she wants to start a group. Um, again, it's, it's a lot of mental with her for some reason. I don't know if she had like a brain tumor or something or, or what. Or something to do with her physically why she died. Yeah, either way, she was like the brain of the group in her mind. So, that's how it was. Oh, I got it. I read my question now. <laughs> what does Florence feel about Mary Wilson's passing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, they're around each other. She's waiting on her, waiting on her, protects her, watches her, showing her the ropes. That's what I'm getting, showing her the ropes. Um, she just pretty much waiting, walking with her um, around family. 
a lot around family when you enter into the next realm you do have family waiting for you or someone waiting to guide you and teach you the rope just like you do on earth when you come out your mother's birth canal or well in these days the new technology uh, out of anywhere you are you're there someone's there to guide you on what to do all right how does Barry Gordy feel felt when Florence left the group <laughs> Barry Gore is actually a very friendly person. He they fuss back and forth arguing like about past stuff like but remember the time? That's the vibe I get. Like just old stuff. They had a struggle. He didn't he whooped it I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm yawning. Once she left, it felt like he was able to do what he wanted to do. Florence was very protective of the other two girls. Very protective of the other two girls. They actually made more money after she left. Um, at least it seemed that way. Um, after she left. They were able to do more things. Again, you, not just because you're doing everything doesn't mean that's that's a good thing in the music industry. You still have to be very mindful of contracts you sign and things like that. So, he was able to do what he wanted at the time. It's more like a yes, 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 Barry, Mr. Gordy. Allegedly. But, um, very nice man. He's a very nice man. Okay. And that completes my reading for, um, the Supreme and I want to thank Florence for damn near taking me over. <laughs> very strong person. Very just whew. I'll see you guys on the next recording. <laughs> recording. See you. Please like, subscribe.